Hey YouTube, welcome to another video on knowledge management. If you're anything like me, you know that feeling of overwhelm when you open your task management app in the morning and you see that long list of tasks waiting for you. It's not the most motivating feeling, but I have a solution that's worked wonders for me called interstitial journaling. Today I'm going to show you a method of interstitial journaling in the Tana app to make you more productive and less stressed. With this method, you will have a clear plan for the day of what you're gonna do and when you're gonna do it without feeling bogged down with a never ending list of tasks. And the best part of this is it's a simple method that you can start using today. So grab a cup of coffee and let's get started. All right, let's start by jumping into Tana and you're gonna be greeted with a page that shows the date and a hashtag day. We're gonna need a couple of tags to create our interstitial journaling template. The first tag is gonna be task, and the next tag we could have for our meetings, meeting notes. And now you can select both of these, a command K to open up the command prompt and convert these into a super tag. Now we've created two super tags, hashtag task and hashtag meeting notes for our interstitial journaling. Great, next we're gonna configure our day tag and this is going to create a template for our daily notes. Click the day tag configure in the template box. You're gonna be able to input your template information. Now the first thing we want the daily tag to show us is a list of all our tasks. So to do that, you're gonna use the command prompt tool. So command K once again and find nodes with the hashtag task that are not yet done. And that's gonna show us all our tasks that are still to be done. Great, that's the first part. And the second part is gonna be a field into where we can enter our journal entries. So I'm gonna create a new field and I'm gonna call this field a time log. And this is gonna be where we're gonna be inputting all our journaling notes. This is the bare minimum for this setup. And you can create more complex setups as you go along. But I just recommend if you're starting out, start really simple and then start building according to your own needs. Great, now we have the day tag set up. We can close the configure panel. And as you can see in our daily note, we have the template where it shows all of our tasks that are not done yet. And then this time log field into which we're gonna start creating our timestamps. So don't just jump into how interstitial journaling works. I usually start with a check-in. So when I'm checking in in the morning, to set the time, just command K, open up the command prompt panel, and then write time, and then this inserts the current time. And this is usually enough to kind of leave a timestamp at what time I'm checking in each day. All this information with the timestamps is useful if you want to kind of reflect on how your routines are working. So just to start with a timestamp, I'm gonna call this a checking in. And what I'd usually do in my checking in timestamp is a little bit of gauging my feeling. So feeling rested, had a great night's sleep. And then once I've done my checking in, I will start thinking of what I wanna get done today. You might be asking why I don't add these into the template. And the reason is that I want to keep the flow as free form as possible without restricting myself too much into this template thinking. I noticed that when I have the space available to add these elements where I want into what space I want to, this helps me with my thinking. It also helps me be more productive. So this is where you can start adding your tasks for today. And what I usually do is I take the day into two parts. So I have the morning and then I have the afternoon. So I'll just start by typing morning in the first part. What I want to get done in the morning. And this usually involves some training of some sort. And I'm not going to add this as a task as it is not a specific task to do, but it's something I want to do every day. But I still want to get that down on paper. You can also add stamps here. So I can say 8 a.m working out and then around 9 30 i want to get a task done so let's say focus time and then during the focus time i can add tasks so write a few paragraphs and then add that as a task i remind you that all these things you can add into the template of the day so if you want to have this structure for yourself you can just add these into the time log so just adding them here into the configure panel as new nodes 
So morning and then afternoon, what I want to get done today. And so I've created a kind of template for my thinking. But as I said before, I prefer not to put those into a template. As for me, some mornings I might have a flight and this template then is not needed. But this is customizable up to your own liking. All right, to continue, I'm going to do the afternoon. I have a meeting with the directors. And right under that, I can actually use the timestamp to add a timestamp to insert the current time and date. And in this way, I can find that later on and then also just hashtag it with meeting notes. And obviously, like anything in Tana, you can customize the meeting notes to have the date included in the template itself. But this is the simplest form. And you can add the notes under the kind of meeting hashtag. These are the notes of the meeting. And in this way, we are creating a flow of information during the day. So once we've got some kind of plan on how we're going to move throughout the day, what interstitial journaling really is, it's actually the flow of the day described in the app. So basically now we have a plan. Yes, there are tasks we want to do. There's a meeting we have. From there, you can start adding notes. So let's say you're working on a task and you have a break. And I usually insert the current time and I say, great meeting with the board today. You can also add the meeting that you had meeting with the directors. Obviously you have the node up in the top and you can check the meeting notes directly on the side panel. For example, you can also open up the notes by shift clicking the link created. And this opens up the notes in line. Interstitial journaling in Tana is just adding tasks within this kind of daily flow or thought flow throughout the day. So I had the meeting with the board today and here are some tasks that came out of the meeting. And then you could just add the tasks here, write the report, add the task super tag. I configured the task hashtag to show as a checkbox and that's required here. Just add this toggle here and that will show them as a checkbox. Now all these tasks that I've been creating throughout the day, they're going to be listed in this query node that we created earlier on for the day. And this shows all the tasks that have not been done yet. And this is great. So it collects all the tasks from that daily flow and collects them into one place. And you're going to have this in the beginning of each daily page. So next we're going to move on to what happens at the end of the day. What I use is a method that I learned from Cal Newport called a shutdown. And that's basically rising the day and closing up the day with thoughts of how the day went in general, what things I've learned and how do I prepare for the next day? So what I do is I create a new hashtag called hashtag shutdown created by command enter and then just add the time. So with the command K, add the time. And in that way, this is good enough for me to start my shutdown protocol. Great day was very productive. Just the mere writing down and kind of reflecting on the day is a very powerful way of creating small increments or small improvements throughout the year towards creating a better self. What I like to do is I like to reflect on things that went well on the day and then also things I could improve upon for the next meeting or the next presentation or whatever it is that you're working on. And doing these small increments through days and then weeks and then months. But the reason I created a hashtag out of it is that during the end of the week, I can create a review of all the shutdowns for the whole week and then go through the main points once again and reflect on how the whole week went. And I'll show you how to do that in a later video. But for this video, I'm going to show you how you can start planning your next day with the tasks that you've created earlier on. So what I want to get done tomorrow, walk the dog, create any task for that. And that also plates the task list. You can just copy nodes and here. And in this way, you'll have an idea of what you want to be working on in the next day. And here you have it, a simple yet effective method of journaling and task management in the Tana app. With Tana, you can break down larger goals into smaller tasks and schedule them throughout the day, providing a clear roadmap for achieving your goals. 
Remember, the key is to be full and experiment with methods that work for you. It's not about being perfect, but actually making progress towards the goals you set out throughout the day. So if you're feeling overwhelmed with a long list of tasks, give interstitial journaling a try as it can make a world of difference. And thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, click like. If you want more content like this in the future, subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Happy journaling. Bye.